Ukrainian journalist Dmitry Gordon believes that the FSB's war with the enemy has reached a new level and the general's revolt is already brewing in Russia. Russian generals whom Putin is arresting en masse are unhappy with the way their generalissimo behaves. He does not allow them to continue to profit from the war, but, on the contrary, throws them in prison. They decided to dump Putin. Of course, Gerasimov and the general staff of the Russian Federation knew that the operation in the Kursk region would happen, if even I knew about it. Specific preparations were underway. It is impossible to hide this. Our people were preparing for more than a day or two. Thousands of people were involved in the preparation, and this inevitably entails a leak. Gerasimov and other generals deliberately did not tell Putin about the operation. The analyst said during a joint stream with Vasily Golovanov, a recording of which can be viewed on the YouTube channel Dmitry Gordon. According to the expert, similar events took place in 1937 to 1939 in the USSR when a large number of Soviet generals were arrested for stupidity and inability to fight, as well as for terrible corruption. At that time, Stalin, with the help of the NKVD carried out an unprecedented blow to the army. Three marshals of the Soviet Union were liquidated, Blusha, Yegorov and Tukhachevsky, and along with them the rest of the Red Army leadership were shot, purging the entire vertical. Gordon also expressed confidence that Russian generals who had contacted Western intelligence agencies would sell out the Kursk region and possibly some other Russian territories. Putin will plunge into the slop, lose his rating and protest movements will begin in Russia. Under the cover of the noise, our guys will start hitting airfields and everything else with Western weapons and Putin will be screwed. Thus, my prediction about the end of the war this year is becoming more and more clear tangible and understandable, the journalist said. Dmitry Gordon also hinted that the events in the Kursk region are only the beginning. Nothing can stop Ukraine.